We have traveled through the states of Minnesota, Wisconsin, Iowa, Illinois, Missouri, Arkansas, Tennessee, Kentucky, and those trees behind me, that is the state of Mississippi. Hey world, I'm Dan and I'd like you to meet Livio, Hannes, Gary, Sebastian and Xander. This is a vlog following our journey down the Mississippi River on a boat made from trash. Along the way we are making a film about giving waste a second life and protecting our waterways. Welcome to the adventure. Good morning ladies and gentlemen, day 38 on the Mississippi River. We just spent a uh, about 15 minutes in this scorching heat doing some microplastics testing. Uh, you may remember from some previous episodes uh, we test before and after St. Louis and Memphis for whether or not there is microplastics that end up in these waterways. Yeah, there is now a long stretch of wilderness before we arrive in Natchez in... Uh in this segment of the vlog, I want to give you guys a little bit of a taste of what it's like when we pull into a sandbar and how we set up camp. So we want to stop at around about 5 or 6 p.m. to find a camp spot because we want to give ourselves about two hours to pitch our tents, cook our food, uh, before the mosquitoes come out at sunset. In other news, we recently met up with an absolute legend of the Mississippi River to interview him for our film, a man by the name of John Rusky, and what a story he has. In 1982, when he was barely out of high school, him and his buddy Sean built a raft to travel down the river, and it broke apart when it hit a navigation tower. And we had lost all control of our lives at that point, and, um, which is a beautiful thing, you know, just to be able to let go and, uh, and feel the, the, the ultimate connection uh, is when you realize that you are not in control, you're just part of this organism. There's an island here created by the Arkansas and the White River in the Mississippi. It's the biggest island in between the Pacific and the Atlantic. <laughs> <laughs> and it's create, an island created by rivers. It's about, you'll, you'll encounter it here at the White River, mouth of the White. We are so excited to announce that the Quapaw Canoe Company and John Rusky are going to be the recipients of our boat Yoko at the end of this expedition. They are going to take Yoko, look after her, and use her for educational purposes here in the state of Mississippi, and they're going to also be using it on any cleanups that they do along the river for the foreseeable future. Mmm, how awesome is that? just cruising along when all of a sudden there was a boat that emerged behind us with flashing blue lights and it struck a chord of fear with us that uh oh we've done something wrong someone's complained about us have y'all seen any other law enforcement out here like this when y'all get down to the ship channel those rollers will be 12 foot high it's gonna be dangerous. this is the most unique vessel I've ever seen on this river <laughs> Good morning ladies and gentlemen, welcome to day 44 on the Mississippi River. However, we are not on the Mississippi River this morning, we are at a golf course. And the reason why we're here is that the wonderful couple that hosted us in Natchez, Mississippi last night, Greg and Gail, um, put us up in a wonderful room and this morning Greg couldn't help but take us down to have a competition here at the golf course. I'm here with my friends from the Trash Boat. We're having of course the championship of the Trash Boat. And for first place, it's, uh, it's how accurately they can strike these irons crisply towards the target out there into the driving range. We have a, a bottle of French champagne here for the first place winner. We're so proud to have you here. And, and uh, we want to bestow upon you this bottle of champagne and we want to thank y'all for making, uh, making uh, everybody aware of the amount of trash that's out on the Mississippi River. Um, and you're a, you're a great winner, thank and you. we really appreciate you being here. Thank you for coming thank to you. Nashville. It 
Ladies and gents, severe thunderstorms rolling through the southern states have kept us off the river for a couple days. However, after hundreds of miles on the lower Mississippi River and many friendly people met along the way, we couldn't be more excited to be arriving in Baton Rouge in the next episode of this vlog where we're going to be meeting up with LSU's Department of Oceanography and Coastal Sciences to see the results from that microplastics research. More next time. See you on the river.